Hello and welcome to our channel. Here you will find all the valuable information on when to sell or buy digital coins, taking into account all the latest crypto news. But before we jump into the news, let's go through the cryptocurrency rates as of today, the 3rd of May. So what we can see that Bitcoin has shown a little decline for the past 24 hours, 0.8%. 9% and right now it is trading at $38,425. Ethereum is now $2,835 and it uh, it has shown the rise for the past day 0.78% but a decline for the past week 4.74%. BNB is $386 dollars 0.10 percent decline for the past day and 2.69 percent decline for the past week okay having in mind all this information i actually suggest to go to the news to know what really affects the raid and what you can get out of this ethereum shows positive signs but this resistance is the key Ethereum formed a base about the $2,750 level and started a recovery wave. ETH was able to climb about the $2,780 and $2,800 levels. There was a clear move about the 50% FIB retracement level of the main drop from the $2,980 swing high to $2,720 low. There is also a key rising channel forming with support near $2,820 on the hourly chart of ETH to USD. Bitcoin mining giants are selling bitcoin call options as a new yield farming strategy as bitcoin continues to stay in a period of strong consolidation and correction bitcoin miners are now resolving to their own way of yield farming bitcoin mining giants like marathon digital and riot blockchain often believe in their hot link strategy for long-term giants However, times of consolidation or long-term bear cycles could be challenges. These companies have huge operational costs in terms of equipment investments, hardware, and electricity bills. Bloomberg reports that rather than selling Bitcoin to raise additional funds, these miners are selling Bitcoin call options to get money out of their holdings as they are adopting the old school yield generating strategy deployed using conventional finance ripple ceo says sack case could resolve this year in a recent interview with fox business ripple ceo brad garlinghouse said that the company's ongoing legal battle with the u.s securities and exchange commission has gone quite well. The case, which is expected to set the agenda for the entire cryptocurrency industry going forward, is now getting close to summary judgment filings. Carly House says that the case could resolve this year, but that is the optimistic view. It's not impossible, the executive said. Argentina's largest two banks to allow crypto trading. Argentina's largest bank has embraced crypto and will allow its customers to begin purchasing for crypto assets, including Bitcoin, through their accounts at the bank. Argentina's largest and second largest private banks, Banco Galicia and Brewbank, have announced that they will allow customers to make crypto purchases. Bloomberg reported on Monday that a resounding 60% of respondents to an Argentinian poll asked for more, for more assets to crypto, which catalyzed the bank's decision to begin allowing crypto trading. Affiliate at market research firm America's Market Intelligence, Ignacio Carballo, tweeted confirmation on Tuesday with 
screenshots of Bank of Galicia's online interface that it had begun supporting Bitcoin, either USD coin and Ripple purchases. And this is something super common for South America because they are actually switching to using not only traditional ways, uh, ways of payments, but also digital ones. And this is a good news for for Argentina and for all those who actually deals with Argentina. Okay, Tron. Tron prices rally 10% on this bullish signal. The Tron token jumped as much as 10% on Monday after the number of accounts on the blockchain crossed a record 90 million. The Tron ecosystem also largely outperformed the broader crypto market over the past week as majors such as Bitcoin and Ethereum declined. Anticipation of an upcoming, upcoming stablecoin is a key driver of interest in the blockchain. The Tron network locked a major milestone Monday. The team disclosed that total accounts on the Tron network have finally breached the 90 million mark. It added that the network boasts more than 3 billion transactions as new people are joining the chain every day. So this is a this is like a new sign to what is happening well with Tron and uh, this is actually like a good sign. So just like keep it in mind. Streaming platform Angel Studios adds Bitcoin to its balance sheet. Streaming platform Angel Studios has purchased $10.6 million worth of Bitcoin, according to its recent filing with the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission. The company states that its Bitcoin holdings are highly liquid. Angel Studios originally made the purchase in October after selling $1.7 million of its Class A shares. The purchase was meant to diversify the company's returns. In December, it recorded an impairment loss of $2.7 million after the cryptocurrency market experienced a massive correction. In January, the company secured $47 million in fresh capital during a funding round led by venture capital firm Gigafund, which is known for its investment in American aerospace manufacturer Space. X. CRO coin falls 19% after crypto.com announces rewards cut down to card holders. On Monday, crypto.com's chronos slide followed suit with a sharp drop after the crypto exchange said it was reducing some staking and rewards tied to its popular prepaid Visa cards. According to TradingView.com, the coin dropped by 19% to $0.265. On Sunday before the announcement, CRO was trading about $0.33 cents per coin. So, that, that's what they said in their blog, I mean Crypto.com. To ensure long-term sustainability, we are introducing any number of changes to the CRO card reward program Effective from the 1st of June 2022. ETH Whale adds 300 billion Shiba Inu tokens amid crypto crash. Shiba Inu prices have declined by 14% in the past week, which has attracted buying by the biggest Ethereum whales. Ships lo losses come amid a broader downturn in the crypto market, which saw most major tokens fall sharply through April. Ship token has consistently maintained its position of being the favorite crypto of the largest wallets. ETH whales have bought over $7.2 million worth of Shiba Inu tokens in the last 24 hours. This has landed the SHIB token on the list of top 10 coins purchased by the ETH whales in the past 24 hours. 
Okay, guys, that's it for today. That's all news. I'm waiting for you tomorrow for a new portion of crypto news. I wish you a good day. Like this video and like other videos as well. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. See you very soon. Bye-bye.